Hi there. For this workout, you will need a chair, preferably with some kind of pad to protect your legs, and a towel, and a hand towel will be just fine. And we're gonna do a little bit of getting back to the basics, gentle Pilates stretch work. So, let's go ahead and lay down. Drape your legs over the chair and just keep the towel handy. Find that comfortable place for your legs to rest. Close your eyes if that feels comfortable. With the arms as well, maybe open them out a bit. Let them rest and begin to take stock and check in with your breath and with your body. No need to change, fix, or tweak anything. Just notice as you breathe in, in and out. As you lay here and begin to melt into the floor, notice if there's any places of tension. Maybe wiggle them. I'm feeling a little bit in my toes and fingers and then let that go. Maybe wiggle your pelvis to turn the hips off. Nod and shake the head. Open the jaw, yawn. And then once again, come back in Back to your everyday effortless breath, sinking into the ground for a few more moments, checking in. Begin to notice your breath a bit more deeply. Where is it coming from right now? No need, again, to tweak, fix, change, just notice. And then let's deepen our breath through our ribs. So let's go ahead and take our hands on either side. Legs are just comfortably flopped. As we inhale, we think accordion. We widen those ribs and fill up. And then as we exhale, maybe we give a little pressure inward with our hands to encourage the closing and connection of those ribs. Inhale to widen and yawn the body. And exhale to fog a mirror and narrow. One more there, widening the waist and the ribs, expanding. Then letting it go and narrowing to connect. Lovely. Take a moment just to bring the hands back down by your sides. Check in back with your everyday breath. And then let's make a little triangle with our fingers. Four fingers touch, thumbs touch. And then take that nice and low. Let's become a bit more aware of our pelvis. Four fingers over the pubic bone, heels of the hands on the hips, thumbs just below the belly button. And like we have a balloon inside, we're gonna inflate the belly as we inhale. And then deflate as we exhale. Inhale to inflate, expand. Exhale to deflate and sink. One more nice expansive inhale. A 
And then deep connecting exhale, let it out. Excellent. Once again, arms return to their comfortable position by your sides. One more deep breath. Try to fill up all of your clothes, your waistband, your shirt, front, back, side to side, all the way around. One huge, expansive inhale, biggest one of the day so far. And then let it go deepest. Exhale, pull your flesh and bones away from your clothing. Squeeze it out. Let that inhale come back in. And again, just feel the weight of your body on the mat. And excellent. Let's find that triangle once again. Let's place it over the pelvis, pubic bone, hip bones, thumbs beneath the belly button. Parallel the legs a little bit more if they're not. Find a nice easy position, maybe even the toes rest or the feet rest against the chair back. And let's just start with some pelvic tilts. So it's like we have a little grape under that lower spine and we exhale and smush that grape. You might notice that your four fingers tip up, right? That pubic bone's a little bit high right now. And then as we do the opposite, we move into an arch. That pubic bone points down a little bit, and we can get a whole bunch of grapes under that lower spine, that sacrum. Exhale to find your pelvic tilt and scoop, smush that grape. Inhale to rock in the opposite direction for that arch. Massaging the back of the sacrum. Right now, try to turn the legs and glutes off so it's really deep internal work with your breath. Inhale to your arch. Massage the sacrum, massage those deep organs. Lots of important things inside there. Inhale and arch. Again, feel free to close the eyes if that helps you move a bit more deeply internally. And in, let's do one more there. Exhale to find that pelvic tilt. And inhale to find the arch. And then lovely. Allow the pelvis just to relax in that Goldilocks just right in between place, neither curled nor arched. And then go ahead and just feel the weight a little bit more at the tailbone. We're in that neutral place, right? That little grape, we're keeping it from being squished. And then let's go ahead and anchor the arms and energize them a bit more. As we exhale, we're gonna float one leg up. Tabletop-ish, maybe it folds a little bit more. We're reaching through the sitting bone. We're trying to keep that grape from being squished. And then we set it back down. And then let's switch. Exhale and just fold. It's sort of this effortless effort, right? This heavy floating, all this wonderful oppositional work. Inhale, let's actually take our hands to our ribs. Let's make that our focus for our stability. As we exhale, the ribs engage pretty deeply so the leg can just easily float. And then the ribs widen to settle back down. And exhale, switch and float. Easy foot. And inhale, release. And exhale. And in, like we're moving in water. And ex. And in. Once more there. And ex. And in. And ex. And release. Let the legs do what they want to do. Take those arms out once again and just let that work go. Hmm. 
Excellent. Come back to a little more parallel. Let's find the towel. And we're gonna make a hammock for the neck. So I'm gonna make mine a little bit wider. I'm just gonna fold it in half. Pick up the head and then take it nice and low under the nape of the neck, yeah? So right by the ears there, making that hammock. Let the arms release, take a big breath in. As we exhale, it's okay if we're arched a little, we soften the ribs, we soften the sternum, we lift the elbows, and then we let the breath, the abdominals, and the arms pick up the head. So no effort in the neck there, it just follows, goes for the ride. Inhale, release back down. Of course, it's some abdominal work, but let's think more that we're stretching the tissue on our upper spine. So exhale, yes, the front body engages, but then the back body just floats and coils and curls and opens. Inhale, release back down and release those arms as well. And then as we exhale, we soften, we scoop and we curl. Inhale, fill up and release. Exhale and head just goes for the ride. Soft jaw, easy neck. Inhale, release. And notice if your pelvis wants to scoop and help, keep it pretty anchored at the tailbone. And then exhale up again. So it's really like we're making a hook with the body, scooping the upper spine, lengthening and releasing the lower spine. And release. Let's do one more there. And exhale and scoop. And maybe we find the bottom tips of the shoulders. Let's pause up here, keep that head really heavy. And we're gonna take a pumping breath. We sniff in, we exhale out. And watch your belly fill up and empty. Maybe we deepen the curl. And a four. Squeeze it out, find your edge. And then release back down. Take a moment to let the arms relax, but just stay present. We're gonna take a spiral. Ah, inhale. As we exhale, we pick up the elbows and we peek around one hip, peeling that opposite blade completely off. And then we inhale, release back down. Exhale and ah, right, we're just stretching that tissue. Protecting the neck, opening up the spine. Inhale, keep alternating. Exhale. Again, just look like we're floating in water. This effortless effort, this heavy lightness. Exhale and spiral. Inhale, release. And just once more each there. Exhale. And in. And exhale. And release. Ah, excellent. Take a moment to let go of the towel. Sometimes even in this effortless, effort, effortless, effortful state, we might feel it, right? So I tend to feel it in my forearms. So let's take a moment and just give them a bit of a massage all the way up to the fingers. You can dig into that thumb joint. When you're ready, switch. Anything goes here, whatever feels good. Shake, shake, shake. And then excellent, let that go, coming back to your mat. Let's put the upper body together with the lower body in the next moment. So find your towel, find a bit more parallel legs, maybe re-scooch. And then let's start with those elbows floated. As we inhale, we fill our body up. As we exhale, we scoop and we fold. And maybe this time we fold a little bit more and curve the pelvis, bringing the knee to the nose. 
inhale release back down again feeling like we're in a hammock and stretching all that tissue along our spine exhale and scoop maybe the pelvis the sitting bones float a little and inhale release and exhale let's keep alternating and release and switch and this time let's do the same thing but add a spiral in the upper body exhale and peek around that hip think forearm to knee and release back down nice massage for the spine switch exhale knee to forearm peek around and back down nice and sustained flow one more each exhale and scoop up and around squeeze and then release and once more exhale spiraling around and release keep the legs released exhale once more make that hammock for the head scooping up 10 pumping breaths in and nine squeeze it out ten <laughs> and then release back down ah take a moment to open the arms reach those legs in a little bit closer and a little bit of a spiral and tick tock for the legs something simple nothing complex just let the knees fall and then switch and then switch and then center excellent let's just massage the spine through a dead bug to finish <laughs> so here we go let's walk those feet to the edge let's let the arms just be kind of heavy let's fold the knees in heavy as well and all we're gonna do is kind of flop over to one side so we open one side and we close and we roll ah, air out the back for a moment and then we roll to the back by picking up the top really everything is heavy we're just massaging from side to side and over once again open the top roll to your back let the hips and shoulders just fall open and then close open and then roll and close a few more there inhale and exhale easy fingers easy toes and x one more there one more back and close and open and close excellent giving that skull a massage as well find your way back to the start back to the chair readjust as you need take your hands back onto the ribs let your knees flop open come back into your effortless everyday breath take that stock take that check-in notice things that have shifted sensations in your body i feel a little bit tingly in my fingers and toes my pelvis feels quite heavy and my ribs actually feel which is difficult for me to feel heavy ah, so let all that go sink into the ground with your breath ah, and thanks for joining me on your mat <laughs>